I hear the Spirit of the Lord say to tell the prophets to get ready to prophesy. For in this season, God is getting ready to release you. To go in some areas right now where you're going to begin to release a word from the Lord that has not been already released in the earth. This is the hour when God is going to give specific instructions, precise words that shall come to pass speedily. Spontaneously, God said many of you will be in places, even in services, and the Spirit of the Lord will come up on you, and you will begin to prophesy. Some words will be words of blessing. Some words will be words of curses, words of judgment against the places that he shall send you. For he has sent many even before you. To give these people a word and they have rejected the word. But in this season, this is a word that is now. In other words, God said, I'm getting ready to bring it for now. As soon as it's released out of your mouth, they should begin to see the manifestation of what is said. And the Lord said, as he send you forth and as you go on these assignments, as you complete the thing that God should give you to speak. The Lord said, flee quickly, for many shall rise up against you in anger to come against you to try to attack you, because the word will challenge them in their sins and iniquities. You must rise up now. Be not afraid. God said, boldness is coming up on you. You will not be afraid of the faces of the people, but you will rise up now, and you will begin to speak what thus say the Lord, because there is a place and a time and a season that God must release a word that will cause the heart of the people to once again fear the Lord and come back to that place of repentance where they will once again serve the Lord with a whole heart. It's preparation time. It's preparation time for the coming of the Lord. And he's sending forth his word now and cause the people to understand that they must ready themselves for the Lord is soon to come. Prophets, get ready. You can't be at ease right now. Prophets, get ready. God is calling you into the secret place right now to prepare you with boldness and strength that no fear will grip your heart as he send you forth to release that word. Be not afraid, said the Lord. Again, I say, be not afraid, but obey me, said the Lord. First of all, I just want to speak that um, the judgment is on you who took from me. Um, all the money that was stolen by way of my mom, giving it to y'all because of who she's with, who she's connected to, and what was originally mine. Um, I... I heard the Lord saying to tell you, he said, tell them, he said, since no one is repenting, There shall be judgment. And I won't keep it from you. The time is now. Time has come. This is now the judgment. Uh, yeah, that woke up shit in the air. When I was back there, and as my wife was singing the song, I heard the spirit of the Lord say, Ah, oh, yeah, 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 that woke up shit in the air. I'm coming out of this. I don't know who that's for, but as you will see it, whatever the devil trying to get you locked up and stuck in, you're coming out of it today. Because there's a sending of north, there's an ascending wind to push you out in the name of Jesus. There's a total of a Sunday. You coming out, you coming out, you coming out, you coming out. I don't care what it's feeling like. I don't care what it looks like. But God has said that you coming all the way out. Come on, the little shit, 
here. Oh, he's been loosened here. He's been loosened here. He's been loosened here. He's been loosened here. And he's going to get out of here. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, he clears in the house. He's 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 clears in the house. The spirit of affection is getting out of here. This is uh, Facebook. How y'all doing? This is a uh, true authority. Uh, we forgot me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of folks folk forgot me. They thought I was going to be dead. You know what I'm saying? A lot of folks thought I wasn't going to make it. I'm going to say this right here. You all keep telling me to stop trying to prove myself. So in this season, I'm more humble than, than usual. I don't need to prove myself to none of y'all. You seen God move, you seen God do what it is. He said it wasn't gonna work. No matter how many times you keep saying what you want to happen, each trial is a different chance for God to pr prove himself and his word that is true and y'all are liars. As his word says, let God be true and let every man be a liar. So please stop mocking me. Stop copying me. Stop acting like you're scaring me. You don't strike no fear here. I don't have to prove that it's no fear here. But just to let you know, God is steady moving. As long as I'm in him and he's in me, he said, as I am, so are you in this world. So he's moving. And guess what I'm doing? I'm moving. You can't stop me. You won't stop me. Well, let me say this too. I don't worship women. 